nice enough to let us use his garage. Um, so today we're going to install R1 Concept rotors and heavy duty brake pads. These are their top of the line Geomet rotors or for performance, track racing, or like this BC that tows our toy hauler around that is 20,000 pounds with the race car. And then we have our heavy duty pads here. Um, they can go up to 1200 degrees Fahrenheit, which is super important when you are braking, you know, with all that load behind us. Um, currently, we had the Hawks in there, the heavy duty Hawks. They lasted us about a year, but they're done. And so are the rotors. So thank you, R1 Concepts, and get going with this. All right, so these are all the tools we're gonna use for the trucky. All right, let's start with the sockets. Got your seven eighths. We couldn't find our 18 mil, so ugh, focus. Did 15 sixteenths. Make sure half an inch right there. Thirteen sixteenths. And five eighths. We got mallet, C clamp, breaker bar, and cheater bar. And of course, you can never do without the BFH. Oh, and what are these if you need? Look at that. Look, look how big. <laughs> yeah, I'm short, man. 5'2 in this tire, but out, yeah, outweighs me for sure. Hopefully. Cool. Not overfilled yet. So. This is what I was talking about, these weird like gold, copper, uh, I don't even know what these are, that come on the factory rotors. Yeah. And there's a so, lot of them on that one. And there's a billion billion on this one. On the back ones, there's only two. So, it's going to be fun. Yeah, wish me luck. <laughs> five hours later. But it needs to be in a French voice, like, five hours later. <laughs> Watch Jamie. <laughs> Watch Jamie in a natural habitat. Look at her rip out these little... Little buggers. <laughs> Look at the frustration on her face. You've never seen a, an inanimate object win over a person anytime soon. Now there's more hands. We have multiplied. <laughs> Oh, we got him out. <laughs> the SUV is kind to me. All the right. truck is kicking my ass. Switch. Ugh. Tag. Tag. One, two. Well, I, I had it right. Don't be hating. Is this a bench press? Tag. Tag. I'm back in. Woo. I can do this. Okay, okay, okay. Wham, 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 wham. Brought to you by BF Goodrich. <laughs> <laughs> Air horn. Insert here. Wham, 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 wham. <laughs> it's hung up on this part right here. Uh, there we go. Yay. So, do you want to see how much brake pad there isn't there? Yeah. That's what towing does. <laughs> and, you know, a 9,000 pound truck. Dude, yeah, how many? We got like what? No, I think we have 30k on these brakes. Yeah, so that's and that's Road Atlanta, New Jersey, Arizona. Oh my gosh, yeah, California. Almost 60,000 miles. Maybe it is 60,000 miles. I guess. Yeah, they, they held up pretty good. But it's time for new and better stuff. And that's why we're getting, as you can tell, if you want to zoom in here, cameraman, see like all the cracks and. Yeah, Pitting. see that heat. Yeah, look at the heat. Like it's gotten so hot, you can tell. Like the paint's been slowly oh. chipping away right there. And oh, amazingly, the other side. Look at this. Had a couple millimeters more. Woo! Woo! Totally safe. <laughs> totally safe. Like there's still is, still one in that one. Right? Like this is so daughter proof. Like we're good. We're good guys. All right. Um, we did come with, um, there are some hardware that Armand did give us that replaces these guys right here. If you can see, you can see that right there. So we'll replace those as well. There you go. Ugh. 
All right, there it is. New hardware. Looks pretty. Blam, blam. Womp, 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 womp. I gotta take out the rotors first. I missed a step. And you need? You need the BFH. The rotors, oh my God, they're so heavy. <laughs> Curl them. Oh, hell no. I can't, wait, 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 wait do it this way. I can't. So you can see like how much more pretty this is. It does have a corrosion protection on these rotors. And then back to back. Uh, the old rotors aren't too bad. I mean, they're you can feel it. They're eating away a little bit, but not that bad. They're pretty similar. So, but now to put the new stuff on. <laughs> Brought to you by Friends of the Garage. Right, thank you, Raggy and Robin. You guys are amazing. The struggle is real, yo. Oh my god. Dude, didn't we have a bigger seat clamp? Nope, that's their biggest. Ugh. I'm dying. I've died. The truck has beat me. I'm done. I'm gonna hand squish it. Oh. Harry, come and assist me. 20 hours later. <laughs> you I'm not the fastest mechanic. I never said I was the fastest, okay? NASCAR, if you're watching this, I can get faster. I can get better. <laughs> For sure they don't do uh, brakes on the truck court. Well, you know what I mean. huh, on the race court. Where you, like, uh, at the 50 yard mark. Yeah, yeah. You just toot. No, I didn't fart. You just tooted. <laughs> rubber. Yeah. The rubber. Though. Yeah, it was totally the, the metal on the metal contact. Okay. Yep. No, nope. it was totally a toot. You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. Whatever. Lady toots. Well, when you got a fart, you got a fart. Like better in than out. Exactly. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Finally. Slay it. Oh my god. So are these brake pads like synthetic or are they like a poly poly formed? These brake pads are semi metallic. What does that mean? How does that how does it translate to good braking? Because it depends on the type of material and each material can the, depending on the comp, how they compound it, it um, handles different temperature ranges. And Especially when you're racing and when you're, you know, that big beastie like this, you want something that can handle the high temp ranges so you don't get a brake fade and you don't smoosh into a little car that cuts you off, you know, when you're towing a 45 foot rig and they think that somehow you're going to magically stop on the dime. Okay, I got to say, during the rear, brakes are a lot easier than the fronts. My God. Brought to you by... So there we go. Heavy duty pads <laughs> with the carbon geomet rotors from R1 Concepts. <laughs> Can't touch this. <laughs> Can't touch this. By the way, when you're doing your brakes and you see that your brake fluid's a little dark, I'd replace it. If we had our own place, I'd be doing that right now. Soon. Soon we'll have our own place and we'll replace our brake fluid. And we'll be making a whole bunch of videos of replacing a Subi engine. Hell yeah! And maybe making a Rally Miata. That'd be a wreck. You should get some. Do uh, it. Yeah. Website yeah. will be on the... Uh, uh, yes. Comment below if you... At me, bro. <laughs> That's right. At me, bros. If there's other videos you want me to do or got any questions, I'll definitely put the website in the description below. Um, yeah, and follow me if you like this video. And um, There will be more to come. There will be more once we get a place. And yeah. that's a wrap. I hear Subi. No. No, I think it's a moto. Probably. Ring, ring, ring. Bwah, 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 bwah.